Innersloth's massively popular social deduction game Among Us got a big new update at the end of March 2021, featuring some new content that the developers likely planned for the cancelled sequel. Folks have got some pretty firm opinions on microwaves. Fans of the game received new cosmetics, modified gameplay mechanics, including custom start positions, and Among Us biggest map yet, the airship. Players have only just begun to explore everything that the airship offers, including new mobility options such as ladders and moving platforms. While some tout them as an easy way to heat leftovers, make a cup of tea, or even bake a cake, others assign blame for all sorts of problems, including uneven heating, dangerous radiation, and even changing the chemical composition of your food. Well, it's time to set the record straight. Microwave ovens began to take shape in the 1940s before really catching on with consumers in the 1960s. However, the real challenge for players adjusting to the new arena is figuring out how to complete all of the tasks the developer has added. The new gizmos were the perfect gadgets for harried housewives to use for easy defrosting and reheating. Over time, as home cooks embraced a more DIY mentality in the kitchen, microwaves experienced a rapid and tumultuous fall from grace. Fans on Reddit have counted at least 20 new tasks for players to complete while trying to hunt out imposters on the airship, although some of these have carried over from previous maps. Tasks that players are familiar with are one thing, but the all-new tasks might confuse gamers just enough that the imposters might get the upper hand. Here is every new task found on the airship, explained. Players will find new short tasks in the armory and showers the brand new tasks added to Among Us on the airship map can be divided into two basic categories long tasks and short tasks. And sure, this kitchen gadget has its share of problems. There are far more short tasks, which are usually single-stage events, so players would do well to start learning those. In the armory, players will find two easy and similar short tasks to complete, put away rifles and put away pistols. After receiving either job, all gamers need to head to the armory and find the appropriate firearms on a table in the center of the room. To complete the task, grab the weapon, head to the gun rack on the side of the room, and place the rifles or pistols back on the wall. Two more short tasks are waiting to be completed in the showers, pick up towels and fix showers. To complete the towel task, players need to find the eight highlighted towels scattered around the showers, pick them up, and then toss them one by one into the hamper near the entrance. But it's far from the devilish dinging box many would have you believe. When used safely and properly, your microwave can be one of your best friends in the kitchen. From radioactivity to mysterious volcanic eruptions and more, these microwave myths are ready to be busted. Microwaves give you cancer microwaves cook using radiation, so it only stands to reason that, much like x-rays and radioactive spiders, they must either give you cancer or a spidey sense, right? Wrong. Microwaves do indeed work by creating a type of low-energy radiation classed as non-ionizing radiation. This radiation causes molecules within a substance placed into the microwave to vibrate, which generates heat. As opposed to the ionizing, and carcinogenic, radiation of X-rays or gamma rays, non-ionizing radiation is similar to that used by your TV or radio, according to the World Health Organization. Fixing the showers simply involves finding the leaky shower head and then hitting it with a hammer until the task is complete. New Among Us short tasks found in the vault, cockpit, and lounge Among Us fans will also find two unique new short tasks in the airship's vault. And much like sitting too close to the radio won't cause cancer, neither will heating up your Craft Easy Mac in the microwave. To top it all off, thanks to the metal walls and metal-lined window of the microwave, those non-ionizing waves stay safely within the magic box until you hear the ding. Long story short, these waves wouldn't give you cancer even if they could reach you, which they can't. Microwaves will interfere with your pacemaker if you or someone you love has a pacemaker. That doesn't mean you can't enjoy some microwave popcorn safely. There, players will need to either complete the dress mannequin task or the Polish ruby task. Head to the vault to find either of these tasks, and either at the giant ruby in the center or the undressed mannequin in the lower right-hand corner. The British NHS lists a handful of household appliances that can damage or interfere with a pacemaker when held too close to it. These include handheld hair dryers, older electric shavers, pagers, and large stereo speakers. The latter do, not to electricity, but to the magnets contained within. Polishing the ruby requires simply interacting with it until it shines, while selecting the mannequin will give the player a selection of clothing to pick from, and players must match the outfit to the model shown up top. Players will find an additional new short task to complete in the cockpit, stabilize steering. 
Not only are microwave ovens not on this list. The NHS even takes care to note that using properly operating microwaves and electric blankets cannot damage your pacemaker. This is certainly a relief for anyone who loves a good bowl of maruchan ramen. This easy task simply involves finding the steering mechanism in the center of the cockpit, moving it to the target position indicated with a green outline, and then pushing the lever on the left all the way up, then back down. Another short task is located in the lounge, where players will find the clean toilet task. This chore is completed by finding the toilet in the lounge, then moving the plunger up and down. That said, the NHS also notes that if ever your pacemaker feels like it's malfunctioning, you should step back two feet from whatever electronic or magnetic device you're using. This shouldn't occur with a microwave, but it's certainly good to bear in mind. You can use a wooden spoon to hold a broken microwave door closed microwaves are far from the most expensive tool in your kitchen, but they also ain't cheap, which means that folks can resort to unique fixes, read, duct tape, to keep their microwave a running and a pinging. If the door seal breaks, however, don't pull a Gracie Hart a la Miss Congeniality and hold it closed with a wooden spoon or any other implement. While the radiation in a microwave is safe, it can leak, and while it's not as dangerous as, like, hanging out in a radiation lab, it's not ideal to have it floating unhindered from your microwave into your home. The EPA notes that since microwave radiation isn't easy to detect, unlike, say, a gas leak, you should always repair a broken microwave instead of trying to fix it yourself. Easy enough, but Valkyrie was not amused when she had to do it. Among us new short tasks in the kitchen, main hall, and records rounding out the airship's new list of short tasks are three easy tasks located in records, the kitchen, and the main hall. Just in case. And especially if you have a pacemaker. Microwaved food is radioactive we've established that the waves in a properly functioning microwave can't reach you. The first of these is sort records, which is located, unsurprisingly, in records. But you're no dummy. Those waves can definitely reach your food. To sort the records and complete the task, players need to grab one of the folders off the table in records, place it on a bookshelf, then grab a second folder and place it in a filing cabinet. Players might also be asked to complete the make burger task in the kitchen. So is food reheated in a microwave radioactive? Short answer. Nope. Remember. The waves used by microwaves are non-ionic. They're not dangerous to you or your food, and they certainly won't make your food radioactive. This is easier to understand once you know exactly how a microwave works. The waves in a microwave, when emitted, cause the molecules within food to vibrate. The vibration of these molecules creates kinetic energy, which results in the release of heat, kind of like when you rub your hands together to warm them up. During the microwaving process, the structure of the food itself is not changed any more than it would be when you boil or steam it. Bottom line. According to the EPA, microwaved food is not now, nor will it ever be, radioactive. If they receive this challenge, they need to make their way to the burger station, where they will be given a recipe to create a burger from five possible ingredients. Unless you're microwaving it next to some nuclear waste. But then you've got more than one problem on your hands, and the microwave ain't it. Microwave safe plastic containers are safe here's one of the only actual dangers of microwaves, their effect on plastic. Plastic contains substances like phthalate and, in some cases, BPA. However, players should be aware that the recipe will change if they leave the station and come back. The last short challenge is one of the two new challenges found in the main hall. The decontaminate task simply involves cleaning the player's avatar, so head to the decontamination sink. Hop in, and wait for the progress bar to drop to 0%. New long tasks located in the main hall, security room, and in the cargo bay one of the new long tasks players may encounter is develop photos, completed in the main hall. This multi-step task requires players to find a highlighted tub in the darkroom section of the main hall, drag three undeveloped photos in it, and then wait for one full minute while the images develop. Players will find another long task in the security room, where they will have to rewind tapes. These substances have been linked not only to endocrine disruption, which, in turn, can lead to metabolic diseases like diabetes and increased risk of obesity, but have also been directly linked to increased risk of cancer. While reducing your exposure to plastics is always a good idea, it's especially true when it comes to microwaves. Microwaving food in plastic, even microwave-safe plastic, has been shown to cause some of these substances to leach into food. And this extends even to plastic wrap that isn't touching the surface of the food at all. 
When microwaved, condensation can form on the plastic wrap and drip down onto the food, essentially making it the same as if you'd microwaved the food in plastic in the first place. To reduce any risk of contamination, only microwave your leftovers in glass containers with silicone lids. Microwaves change the DNA structure of water o. Wow! Lots to unpack here. To complete this task, players will have to find the tape station and then use the rewind and fast forward buttons to match the tape's position with a note on the front. The cargo bay contains a third long task, unlock safe. So first off, water doesn't have its own DNA, changeable or otherwise. This task requires players to interact with the yellow safe they will find there and then manipulate the dial by following the instructions on a piece of paper taped to the safe. You can't change something that doesn't exist. But semantics aside, microwaves don't actually change the structure of anything they are used to heat. Microwaving water just vibrates the molecules of the liquid, causing it to heat. To complete this process, players must move the dial in the direction that the arrow is pointing until the red dot reaches the number specified. Players must then complete this process two more times before the mechanism on the right-hand side finally lights up. The last new Among Us tasks are located in ventilation and electrical Among Us players will find two more tasks with new mechanics in the electrical and ventilation areas. No structural changes whatsoever. Some experiments seem to show otherwise. The new electrical room task is called Reset Breakers, and it simply involves finding the seven breakers and pulling each one in numerical order. One widely popularized one seems to posit that microwaved water kills plants, for example, and while the photo, evidence, certainly seems believable, it's far removed from a double-blind study performed in a lab. We don't purport to know exactly what's behind these images, but in reality, the only way microwaved water could hurt your plants is if it's too hot, or if there were pathogens in the container used to heat it. Players will know the correct order because each breaker will display a number listed after it is selected. The idea that a microwave would actually be able to change the chemical composition of water is one that we can say, beyond a shadow of a doubt, is bunk. Microwaving water for tea is a good idea. Microwaving water might not change its structure, but it can overheat it. This translates to a potential for injuries. The FDA cautions that microwaving water can cause serious burns and even eruptions. Aha! We hear you saying. Players just need to find the next numbered breaker to avoid resetting the sequence. The final new task in Among Us is completed in the ventilation room and is called Start Fans. This task seems simple, but it is made more difficult by the distance that players need to travel to complete it. A seemingly volcanic eruption of water is proof positive that microwaves do indeed change the structure of water. Hold on, there. Let's look at the science. Water boils at 100 degrees C. That boiling phenomenon is usually visible by the bubbles of vapor that come to the surface of the water as it boils. But if water is microwaved in a completely clean cup, those bubbles might not form, despite the water being at boiling temperature. This means that when you go reaching for your cup of hot water, the movement causes the water, which is already at a high enough temperature, to actually boil. To finish this task, players need to find the access code, represented by a series of gems, which is revealed at the side terminal in the cargo bay. Out of the cup and all over your hand. Then players need to run around the ventilation shaft, back to the side of the showers, and enter the code there. Ouch. To avoid this, always heat water in an electric kettle or on the stovetop, and reserve microwaving for liquids like coffee that have particles in them that keep this sort of false boil from taking place. Microwaves make your veggies less nutritious myths about microwaved food being cancerous aside. Some people believe that zapping food saps the nutrients from it. The task, as Valkyrie has demonstrated, becomes much easier if the player is a ghost. Completing these tasks makes it possible to win the game without even spotting the imposter, although making accusations is still a vital part of playing through Among Us new map, the airship. And what's more, some studies seem to prove this to be the case. At least one study has shown that microwaving reduces the glucosinolate content of broccoli more than other cooking methods. But the reality is a lot more complicated and has far more to do with the amount of water in which veggies are cooked than the cooking method itself. With many vegetables, specifically, members of the cabbage family, like broccoli and Brussels sprouts, microwaving actually retains nutrients better than other cooking methods like boiling, according to one 2010 study. Some folks also claim that microwaving nitrate, and nitrite-rich foods like kale and beets, could convert the nutrients into carcinogenic compounds known as nitrosamines, but research has shown that when it comes to nitrite-rich bacon, microwaving is actually the cooking method that produces the lowest number of these compounds.
so it seems pretty safe to microwave your kale. If you want your kitchen to smell of sulfur, that is. Microwaved cakes are tasty and safe microwaved mug cakes may well be tasty, but their safety is called into question when they feature eggs. Microwaves are notorious for cooking food unevenly, which you know if you've ever dug into a slice of lasagna that's hot on the edges and ice cold in the middle. This propensity for cold spots not only means microwaves are not a safe, or, frankly, palatable, way to cook meat, processed or otherwise. It also means that other foods that can contain dangerous pathogens when not heated to an appropriate temperature, like eggs, might not get fully cooked in the microwave. Attempts to correct this issue can make your mug cakes far less palatable. Too long in the microwave, and you end up with scrambled cookie. Too little, and your lava cake could lead to food poisoning. To ensure that your mug cake is as safe as it is delicious, there's a simple fix. Seek out a recipe that is eggless. Presto. Your chocolate mug cake dreams are now a reality. Microwaving your sponge makes it safe to use forever. What's that old riddle? The more it cleans the dirtier it gets. Sponges are breeding grounds for bacteria, and in an effort to be more eco-conscious, we've been using our kitchen sponges more and more in lieu of paper towels. Enter a cool little trick for cleaning a dirty old sponge. Dampen it with water and then send it for a minute-long trip through the microwave. This will kill most bacteria on the sponge, making it safe to use in your kitchen again. That said, beware of relying on this trick too often. While microwaving a sponge kills most of the bacteria, and, of interest, the most dangerous ones, it won't kill all of them. And the ones that will stick around may not be the most dangerous, reports NPR, but they are the stinkiest of the bunch. Moral of the story? When your sponge smells awful, pitch it. It ain't rocket science. Microwave meals are awful for your health. Microwave meals and TV dinners are often full of salt and preservatives, not to mention sold in plastic trays, which, as we've previously discussed, is not the healthiest microwave vessel. But just because many microwave meals are typically not great for you doesn't mean all microwave meals are awful. In recent years, a number of companies have shifted to healthier microwavable alternatives. While the bad ones are still around, there are now plenty of tasty frozen dinners to choose from. Alexia makes organic mashed butternut squash that's easy to heat in the microwave. Amy's Kitchen, meanwhile, produces organic microwavable meals, including a vegan chili mac, that are packaged in paper trays with microwave-safe overwrap. Healthy Choices microwavable power bowls, meanwhile, are sold in a plant-based fiber container that's safe to microwave. In short, just because it can be heated in the microwave doesn't mean it's awful for you. Seek out meals without too much added salt or sugar, and be sure to verify that the tray or bowl in which the meal is meant to be heated is made of a non-plastic substance. The last thing you want is those endocrine-disrupting phthalates spoiling your dinner. Microwaving breast milk is a safe, easy way to reheat it. Most food is absolutely safe to heat in the microwave. There's only one real exception, and that's breast milk. Heating breast milk in the microwave has a number of downsides, the first and worst of which is that, due to uneven heating, it can create hot spots that can scald the baby's mouth or tongue, according to the FDA. And if this wasn't bad enough, these hot spots can actually cause breast milk to begin to deteriorate from a nutritional and immunological point of view, according to one 2015 study. Breast milk's qualities begin to deteriorate at 104 degrees Fahrenheit. But if you're reheating in the microwave, Hot spots can be far hotter than this, even if you only warm the milk to a recommended 98.6 degrees Fahrenheit. Nursing moms who want to reheat pumped breast milk would do well to reheat it in a dedicated bottle heater or else in a pot of warmed water that's already been removed from the heat, says the CDC.